Oh no. We've got... What are these... What are these things called anyway? I can't even remember. <laughs> like I've tried to er erase extinction from my mind and now it's coming back to haunt me in the form of this custom map. Uh, nope, can't remember what they're called. But Why are they not blowing up? There we go. Give me your insta kill. So, uh, yeah. We've unlocked the um, the three gnome thing. We should probably try that out. I might as well get all the perks in the map, eh? Let's just chuck down a couple of these back here. Not that they'll last very long because there's a spawn back there. And we didn't really check which perks we unlocked either. So we should probably... Let's use this. Let's use the gnome protection and see what it does. Interesting. So, the zombies are just dying for no reason. I thought, I thought there was going to be a bunch of gnomes spawn in and start running around killing zombies or something weird like that. Or they were going to shoot lasers from their eyes. But apparently it just gives me like an aura of death or something. Um, similar to that, uh, there, was a, there was a map I played a while back called Cube where the trap like basically gave you like an electric shield that killed all the zombies that came near near to you so it's sort of like that all right we're gonna fill this chest now that's our next thing we gotta do oh what happened yes we feel the chest speak of the devil we hit that nuke so the other thing that i want to do is i want to check which perks we've unlocked um I can't remember. Oh, part. Okay, so we get the part. Now, can we build this somewhere? So we got that first part from... Um, how did we get that first part? Oh, that's right. The um, the Easter eggs that we found. The, the mini Easter eggs. Six of six. So yeah, you got you got to find the six Easter eggs for the first part, and then you got to fill the soul chest for the second part. Oh, okay. That is stopping power. I might want to get that. I might want to get that particular perk. If, oh no! Oh no! I nearly got <laughs> that. Were grabbing onto me right there. I've got to be careful. Getting distracted. Let's buy this. Two thousand perks challenge completed. It's another one down. We haven't found the ending yet either. Although it's probably triggered when you've done all the challenges, I imagine. That's how the last Deadshot Daiquiri might as well. Oh, it has given me a laser sight. That one I still have to do, 15 rounds. But we'll get that next round for sure. Guaranteed. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh, that's another part. So that challenge wasn't a perk machine. That challenge was a part. An egg. So I'm guessing we make a stuff. Now we've got the three parts. That one's 3,000 points. Wait, how many points? 35,000. Yeah. <laughs> Already got 3,000. So where do we build? There's the round challenge. Where do we actually build the stamina up? Okay. Definitely want to get all the perks. I might have to get some more ammo in a second here. I pr it's probably a good idea if I if I kind of run back and forth between where the ammo is for the AA-12 because the AA-12 is just like it's just getting it done for me. This thing's okay, but it's kind of got a bit of um, projectile drop on it. it. Makes it a little bit unpredictable. You have to be super precise with your aiming, whereas the AA-12 has got a bit more forgiveness, a bit more spread. With a fire pattern and stuff like that. Mind you, this thing's got a lot of ammo and a really high rate of fire. Oh, I should have kept that crawler, probably. How did I get that crawler? Did I shoot him in the legs or...? Not quite sure. Um, also not quite sure where I'm supposed to build the stuff. This is pretty awesome looking, this VR-11. <laughs> Okay, dying from the gnome protection. 
Suckers. Stamina, we already got that. Um, Alright, here we go. This is where we build. Of course it's where we build it. It's the only spare build table in the map. <laughs> electric. The electric... Oh no. Electric staff. Of course. Yeah, this is the same as in uh, Dawnville as well. It's it's okay-ish, but I'm probably going to rely on the AA-12. I mean, it's got lots of ammo, but it's just... Uh... Oh, there's the points challenge. All challenge, end game unlocked. That's what I'm talking about, because it's starting to get pretty intense in here. Uh-oh. You gotta be careful using that stuff because it kind of freezes the zombie in your path while they do the stun animation and then you can get blocked off. Oh, what's this? Okay, that's the end game. We've just gotta finish the current round to, to, uh, to beat this crazy map. We can do this. Oh, well then again, maybe we have to finish the round and then it goes on a timer because that's what Dawnville did. Uh, we'll find out anyway. I'm guessing that's what's going to happen. It's kind of weird that there's no Pack-a-Punch in this map. Unless I've stupidly missed how you open it. PhD Flopper, baby! Yeah! Let's chuck some of these down. So we got to finish the alien round. Come at me, aliens. Make sure that one was dead. God damn it. Those eggs, man, they're so... You have to be super accurate and calculate for the, for the like, uh, the trajectory and everything. Chuck some of these down. I wish, I wish a couple of the spawns hadn't been put where they are though, because you can't really camp in this map much. You have to keep moving. It's not the easiest map to run trains in either. Oh, okay, we got the timer now. Five minutes. Survive for, for five minutes. And we have the aliens spawning in with the zombies. This is going to get crazy. No pack punch. We can do this. I've got a feeling I'm going to get through most of my ammo here unless we get a max ammo at some point. Oh, no. Woo. I've nearly done it a couple of times in this game. You wouldn't want to go to a much higher round than this one because the zombies are getting pretty tough to kill. Oh no, keep moving. Yes, got to use the gnomes. Use the power of the gnomes. It saves ammo as well. We got an insta kill over there. I'll go grab that when the gnomes wear out. Which is about, about now. Uh! Oh no. Let's go back this way. Ammo, thank you. Okay. I probably should have just ran those last couple of zombies around and cheesed it, but let's go to the next round, I guess. We've only got three and a half minutes left to beat this map. Still got a little bit of the insta-kill going. I'm going to have to hang out back where the ammo is at, though. Man, even the eggs, the egg grenade things, they only, like, blow off limbs. They don't actually kill the zombies anymore directly. Uh-oh. Oh, man, this is getting crazy. Oh no, oh no, 
Gnomes! Yes! <laughs> I'm so glad I unlocked those gnomes. What's that back there? Is that max ammo? Beautiful. We can replenish the staff. I think there's a nuke here as well. Uh, let's just wait on it a little bit. There we go. Good, good, good. Two and a half minutes to go. Can we do this? Yeah, this map takes the cake for a sheer number of Easter eggs. Alright, that is the last zombie, I think. Let's just keep going. Sort of okay with ammo at the moment. I think it's taking us about 30 seconds around at the moment. Oh no. Oh god. Okay, known protection again. I'm just going to abuse the hell out of that trap. Saves his ammo, that's for sure. I love how they just die when they get close to you. <laughs> Except it's worn out now. Oh man, I gotta focus here. Let's hit that. Get more ammo, not taking any chances. At least we don't have to buy a super expensive viable ending. Okay, one minute left. Oh no, oh no! Oh no! Oh man, that was crazy. This is a bad spot. This is a bad spot. Oh no! Oh, that was uh, a little bit of a close one. Round 20, here we go. Final 30 seconds, starting now. That ain't good. Okay, come at me, zombies and aliens and whatever else you've got. Oh, it's, a, it's an alien round. That makes it easy. Relatively speaking. Won't even need the, um, the help from the gnomes. There it is. Game over, guys. That is a map called Easter Basket. Hope you enjoyed. Please remember to rate and comment. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Slippery Jim, out.